It's locked. Since I can't reveal myself to my mother now, I must find a discreet spot to attend the ceremony. Avery, I leave you to care for my mother. I'm in no state to comfort her. would die if she were to see me in this state. I must wait. Mother, why have you come here? This is proving far worse than I imagined. Avery, I leave you to care for my mother. I'm in no state to comfort her. Mother, why have you come here? This is proving far worse than I imagined. she were to see me in this state. I must wait. I am the 
resurrection and the life. He that believeth in me, though he were dead, yet shall he live. And whosoever liveth and believeth in me shall never die. We commend unto thy hands of mercy, most merciful Father. The soul of our sister departed, and we commit her body to the ground. Earth to earth, ashes to ashes, dust to dust. Kill my Mary and stick her here in this cold, god awful place. <laughs> These are the legal requirements for the epidemic, madam. Oh, Avery, I feel so tired. Please take me home. Yes, madam. <laughs> Jonathan, there is nothing you can do but accept it. What brings you here? I thought you could use the company. I am so sorry for your loss, Jonathan. I wish the tears would come. your humanity. Don't be so quick to lose it. She had been scouring the most dangerous parts of London in search of me, and it led to her death. Jonathan, don't. I still will hear her last thoughts. They echo in my head. Her mind shattered, and... and it haunts me. Jonathan, stop. Listen carefully. You must come to terms with this. You must learn to live with what happened. How is it possible? Tell me. Is it so easy to take a life every night and then just smile and nod at those you spared? Don't you see? You're doing the work of our enemies, feeding your remorse. We are weakest when we grieve and the guilt blurs our senses. And so this is why you're here. To warn me. You felt this pain yourself. You too have endured this. I don't want to lose you, Jonathan. I've lost so many friends. Loved ones I cherished. Pray for Mary's forgiveness, if you must. You may be right. Of course. I've stared upon this world for centuries, and time has taught me to deal with guilt, if not erase it. What should I do then? St. Mary's Church is not far from here. Go there and make your peace. Find the solace you need. My lady wants me to confess. No, Jonathan. It's you who wants to confess, I think.
After Georgie goes, a newborn seeking divine consent to lick the blood from the soft and pointy crown. Who are you? Make yourself known. Newborn, you reek of guilt and pointless compassion. Shed your skin, forget your old weaker self. What do you want from me? Ascalon does not approve of lone wolves who bring unwanted eyes to our pastures. So your name is Ascalon? <laughs> Ascalon's will is vampire law. Learn them, abide by them, or I shall return as your judge and jury. These immortals try my patience with their plans and unsolicited counsel. Best run of God! This man stunned me with his oath, his crucifix. This is not good news. Yes? What is it that you want? I'm sorry to disturb you at such a late hour. No worries, my son. I'm still quite awake, having just returned from a funeral. Yes, I know. I've forgotten what I wanted. I don't know... You seem somewhat perturbed. I haven't the strength to cross the threshold. I wish to pray, to cleanse my soul. The church is shut, 
by order of the bishop. But I'm still the vicar of St. Mary's, if that is any use to you, my son. Take no offense, vicar. I seek just a moment in nothing but my own company. There are no secrets from God, my son. If your heart needs comfort, consider me your chapel. For I can be as silent as stone. I've made myself perfectly clear. This is a private matter. Your eyes burn with rage, yet I see the pain that lies beyond. I am here to lighten the burden of all God's creatures. Whatever you tell me is between us and the Lord. Very well, priest. Open your heart, my son. Tell me what burdens you. With whom do you wish to speak? She was my sister. You seem so troubled by the loss of this girl. What happened to her? She was murdered. I see. And how are you feeling, my son? She died because of me. How do you think I feel? Final question for you, my son. This is of the utmost importance. Ask your question, Vicar. What words would you like to say to your poor sister? I killed you. There's no excuse. My dear Mary, forgive me. You have been heard, my son, and your burden will lighten if your words are sincere. Go in peace now, and live your life in the way she would have wanted. There. I can... Fest to that vicar. Do I feel better? Only time will tell. I cannot enter. Good evening, Doctor. Can I help you? Have you any news of Nurse Crane and her dispensary? Without a proper investigation, her death will go unpunished. Another Whitechapel tragedy. One that people need to hear about. Goodbye, Mr. Darby. Farewell.
is it you seek? This age is sickly. An ancient poison, an older rage, brewed in a cauldron newly forged. This has something to do with the epidemic. Seek truth, my champion. Defeat the servant of knowing with iron spurs. 